Hey guys, it's Shay from Chasing Shay. And today is my last day in South America. I fly home in the morning. While I was packing, I figured why not show you guys a video of everything that I brought with me since I had such a hard time packing for this trip. To preface a little bit about the trip, we did a mix of activities, adventure sports, city exploring, beach days as well. A little bit of everything in there. I started in Bolivia, went through Chile, went to Argentina, went through Uruguay, and then ended in Brazil. So I've hit a big range of weather and temperature and altitudes and everything in between, but I felt really prepared with everything that I brought. There was never really a moment that I needed something. I packed everything into a carry-on size backpack. I did carry it on with me on the plane, so all my liquids and everything are travel size. Um, and then I have my 15 liter day pack as well. I'm gonna show you everything that I packed. Hopefully this video helps somebody decide what you wanna pack for your trip to South America as well. Enjoy. Three tank tops, three t-shirts, three long sleeves, a cardigan, a fleece throwover, a down vest, and then a windproof, waterproof, fleece line jacket at the end. For the bottoms, I did a pair of jeans, a pair of jean shorts, a black skirt, a long pair of black athletic leggings. So here's what everything looks like all packed up inside the packing cubes. On the right, we have shirts, bottoms, pajamas, swimwear, socks, underwear, bras, all that fun stuff. Here we have fleece, down vest, and my cardigan. And then over here, I forgot to mention, I also have a sleep sheet and travel towel. Up at the top, we have my jacket just wrapped up into its hood. And then of course over here, my toiletries. For my shoes, I brought a pair of black waterproof boots. I brought a pair of rubber sandals, which doubled as my shower shoes and my Tiva hiking sandals. This is all the stuff that I bring along with me. Now this gets mixed between my day bag and my main pack, just depending on the day. And we'll start over here on the left with my purse. I actually had to buy that purse because mine broke during the trip. And that carries passport, phone, wallet, headphones, sunglasses, things like that. My water bottle with my life straw filter, which was amazing. It saved me so much money on water. And of course, just great for not buying more plastic. In the case at the top, that is my camera that I'm filming on now. I did bring a blow dryer and a straightener, both mini size. The straightener was a vanity thing but the blow dryer was the first time I traveled with one and it was amazing because I was here during South American winter and wet hair and winter do not go well together. I have some chargers, more chargers. This is kind of a random bag of goodies, jewelry and extra headphones, a deck of cards, extra tissues, just kind of random stuff. Up here at the top we have instant coffee packets and Pedialyte packets as well. I have like a spork in there, just kind of random food extras. The glorious fanny pack of course. Some bug spray wipes, Kindle, GoPro, reusable bag. That was great just to stuff groceries or laundry or whatever I needed into. My neck pillow, which I had to buy on this trip because mine broke on my flight down here. My eye mask, the headlamp, a little locking cable, which was fantastic for the trip for all the times that I had to leave my luggage in kind of sketchy places. GoPro accessories, sarong, wet wipes as well. All these things were super useful during the trip. I was really happy that I packed all of them. This is my backpack. It's the REI Ruck Pack 65. It's a 50 liter main pack that comes with a detachable 15 liter day pack. Okay, we're gonna see how everything in here packs up. Turtle. Woo Here's all my stuff. I'm all packed up, ready to go home tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a like and subscribe. See you later.